Good morning, good afternoon, or good night, or whatever time it may be in your part of the world. My name is Mr. John Wayne, and I am a variety gamer. I play everything from the Fallout franchise all the way to the Soulsborne series. Welcome, everybody, to another episode of my Let's Play of The Lies of P. I hope you're all doing well. I know that I am. And today, we're going to continue exploring Rosa Isabel Street. But before we do, let's go ahead and talk about everything I did off screen. And really all I did was farm up a little bit of ergo and leveled up until everything was 20 except for my technique. I didn't have enough to uh, put my technique up by one. But that's okay. All right. With that all being said, let's go ahead and get started. I'm going to start by talking to this guy here. Oh, huh. you're walking about in a place like this. You must be a stalker. Can I ask you a favor? My wife's body lies on Rosa Isabel Street. There was a fire, and I couldn't reach her through the flames. I know she's gone, but I hate to think of her just lying there. Would you bring me her belongings? Then I'd have something to remember her by. <sighs> Thank you. Small kindnesses like this give me something to cling to. Her body is on Rosa Isabel Street. She used to look so beautiful in her black dress. I miss her so much. Every day is harder than the last. Please, bring me her belongings. Okay. Um, well, I guess we'll continue further. Oh, great. Sewers. My favorite. That guy, uh, throw a turd at me or something? If he did, it kind of hurt. It's a pretty hard turd. Mm, we could fall down there. But I'm not going to, not just yet. Unless we have to. <laughs> Stop throwing turds at me, homie. continue up here oh my god you are no joke that hurt oh I did change out my grindstone by the way to electricity just because we're fighting a bunch of puppets Shit. <laughs> Blew that lady up too. Awesome. I want some more crescent moons. 
I want to level this up. This seems like a fun um, weapon to use. Let's come over here and open up this uh, door. Speaking of crescent moons. So we have a way back here if we need. I want to come back down here. I want to hop down that area that we did not explore. I thought it was natural progression to be honest. Hop down here. That's a moon. Sweet. Okay. You and those turds, man. Oh, they're on the ceiling, too. More on the ceiling. <laughs> Holy Jesus, so many. Let's go up here first. I think I can handle that guy. I'm not scared of those guys, but let's open up a shortcut, I suppose. Perfect. Yeah, those guys aren't scary to me anymore. Those guys are. Awesome. Worth coming over here. That quartz alone. How many quartz do I have? Just one. I need two more to level uh, another thing up. Part of my P organ is what I mean. All right, let's go through the shortcut that we opened up. We'll just keep progressing. We've opened up quite a few shortcuts. That's nice. Oh, look at you. Oh, 
Oh, we need to backtrack real quick. We need to backtrack. And is that where his wife is? Probably. He said there was a fire, so... Oh, there's a fire over here, too. Um, and it looks like a ball that's going to roll down and try to kill me. So I guess I better be prepared for that. There was an explodey lady over here. Right? Yes. Was it worth going down there? It is not. Sorry if I'm jerking the camera around a lot. Herald Theater. We need to find that guy's wife. Oh my god. Oh my god. Was not ready for that. At all. Okay, you're a bastard. Oh, those baby things again. Creepy little babies. You ain't fooling me. Okay. You are fooling me. Who in their right mind would want a puppet like this? I mean, look at that thing. Heavy weight frame. Uh, yeah, let's put it on. Oh, wait, there was something else, maybe. No. Yes, this right here. I forgot that I got that. I would like to get better liner, but I don't know. I haven't found anything that's better. We found it. The black dress. But it's just a puppet. What on earth is going on? Seriously. Oh, didn't we read something before about a dude marrying a puppet and his family like broke in and like beat the shit out of the puppet or him or something? I think I remember reading something about that in like a, a I think it was in Vanini's workshop. We read something about that. Okay, so this is a huge um, shortcut if we need it. But first, before we traverse down that way, let's go talk to that guy. Give him this wedding ring. Be like, yo, we found your robot wife. I guess weirder things have happened. People marry bridges and... Uh, cars so why not marry a robot at least it can talk to you <laughs> nothing against people that are marrying bridges and cars and you know stuff like that but just saying hey bud we found your wife oh my melody this is her wedding ring all marriage should have been filled with joy 
I failed you, Melody. I'm sorry. I should have mentioned she's a puppet. But she was real to me. I saw a shining soul inside her. Others laughed at me, but I knew the truth. I knew that she was in love with me, too. Maybe I'm crazy, though. <laughs> Who ever heard of a human and a puppet in love? Melody. My Melody. Your words were everything to me. <laughs> she was my guardian angel. The reason I survived the Krat disaster. Even puppets have hearts, do they not? Perhaps all we need is something that helps us perceive what they're feeling. <sighs> Sorry. I ramble when I get upset. Here's your reward. I think you deserve this ring more than I do. I'm more than happy with Melody's belongings. I wish I could offer something more, but this is all I have. Please, remember the love Melody and I shared. Who knows? Maybe you'll find true love one day, too. We got the sad gesture. I lied to him too. I don't know if that's bad. But I feel bad for that guy, man. Like his family, like, didn't approve of him. And then, like, then this all happened. And he lost his robot wife. I know that sounds a little weird to say, but, you know. Different strokes for different folks, right? Uh, we'll come back to that in just a moment. First things first, I want to come over here. I want to go rest at a stargazer, and then we'll come back and... Oh, you bitch! Try not to get snuck up on again. Let me change this out as well. Let's see. Those throwing cells might come in handy. Isn't there an enemy up top here? No. Thought there was, but apparently not. Let's see. 
how tough you are, bud. Okay, I remember seeing a rolly ball. Yep. You're not fooling me, bud. Advanced crank. Oh, fucking flamethrower, guys. Eh, come on. Let's bring you over here. Try to group you up. And I see a bomb throwing guy over here. Good lord. It's probably not going to be too fun. Oh god. He's a mini boss. Oh, holy shit, dude. Bastard. All right, let's go ahead and give this another shot. Hopefully we can do better this time. Oh, I forgot about that stupid ball. Damn flamethrower, guys. Yep, group up. That's perfect. Thought they dropped something. Oh, those guys are annoying. Not when they give me crescent moon stones, then they're not annoying. Then they're rather awesome. Let's lure this stupid clown guy over here. I think I'm going to try to lure him back as far as I can so we can fight him without anything interrupting. Come on, bud. You freaky little dude. Oh my god! No! kind of cheap, but I don't care. I'm going to be real with it. Yeah. 
Oh, wow. Fucking uppercut, man. Bastard. This clown right here. you clown boy <laughs> we got a quartz for all of that oh man let's go rest at the stargazer that was a really cheap um way of killing that guy and oh my goodness almost went to the wrong spot right where the hell is okay stargazer's over here it's like where the hell is the stargazer now that i've been like fighting and getting discombobulated Getting all turned around and shit. We got no health. Hopefully, I, I don't think that clown would come back. I think it's a one-off because he's like a mini boss. God. What? Oh my goodness. Where? What am I doing? What am I doing? Who knows what I'm doing? Because I don't. I know I'm trying to find the stargazer and failing at it. Awesome, another crescent moon. How many do we have? Five? Nice. Man, I feel really cheap <laughs> with killing that clown the way that I did. Uh, but man, I kind of don't. Okay, that flaming ball of death isn't there anymore. Thank goodness. All right, you, you guys come this way. What are you guys doing? Come on. You were so interested in me whenever I was fighting the uh, clown. Now you want to back off. Second one throwing shit at me now. Where's he at? Oh, good lord. Everything wants to kill me. Anything else? I thought there was an item over here. There it is. want to bring that lady some wine but I haven't seen 
anything where there's wine. I think she said in a cellar or something. We have so many star fragments, it's ridiculous. Oh. This looks cool. Although we're gonna light the uh, stargazer. Collect some stuff around here and then we're gonna end the video. It's probably gonna be robots. We're getting electric blitz stuff. Um, let's see if we can't do this. Nothing. Okay. Fair enough. So there's a shortcut somewhere around here. Probably around back, I'm being honest. I wonder if we're going to be able to get on those trolleys or those whatever they are, monorails or something. Um, I think that's all there is to get. Alright, so I guess we'll end the video right about here. And then off screen, I think I'm going to do a little bit of grinding um, on those crescent moons to level up this um, sword over here. I want to check it out, see uh, how it is. And um, probably grind out a few levels as well. Because I want to start leveling up just vitality, motivity, and technique and then get advanced up to 10, at least up to 10, uh, to see if that helps with damage on our electrical fire and acid attacks. All right, now that that's all been said, I want to start by telling everybody thank you so very much for stopping by and watching the video. I really do appreciate it. Hopefully you all enjoyed it. If you did, go ahead and hit that thumbs up button. If you didn't, hit the thumbs down button. Let me know why down in the comments below. It only helps the channel. Also, if you enjoy content just like this, be sure to subscribe or don't. I don't know. I'm not your dad. Do whatever you want. And like always, everybody, have a good morning, a good afternoon, or a good night, whatever time it may be in your part of the world. Mr. John Wayne, signing off.